Off again today to Itchinor Harbour, to go out in Chichester. It's a nice place, so we thought we'd take the Conway. Here we are on the A27, making our way from uh, Netley near Southampton uh, to Itchinor Harbour near Chichester um, for a little go in the home wave. Shit me. Here we are at Itchinor Harbour on the public hard. Setting up right on the hard. You can set up here and then go to the car park to leave your car. Lovely calm day, sort of high water now. It's a really nice place. Now indoors has gone off to try and find somewhere to pay. Five quid it should be. There's one stink waiting patiently to go in the boat. And there's the other stink unfurling the boat. I say again, what a lovely place to launch. Once again, we find ourselves with twin and wits running. Pumping up the 2.8 IE2. After you set up, you drive to the car park, which is operated by the same people. Pay there, coins or card, but I couldn't make the card work. It's five pounds for 12 hours, which is very cheap, I think. So to give you some idea of the walk from the car park, it really isn't that far. That's a nice secure car park. Down this little lane, turn left, and then you're at the hard niggly. That was Mr. Thicky. There is a cafe there. It's not down that little lane, that's a private drive. It's down this road. Turn left, what an idiot. So here we are, turn left here, walk down here. Bus load of coach load of people just dropped off. To what look, which looks like a very nice pub. And you walk further down here to the hard. There we come the, to the hard and there's her indoors patiently holding the boat and with the dog pulling in the other direction. If are feeling very rich, there's a property here for sale. And there's the harbour office. Hello, stinks. Going in the boat, Bobby. Very tough. Out on the water once again in the little sieve. This one takes with all the bits and pieces we have about an hour to set up. Maybe treat as part of the experience, it's no big. Extra pain today, aren't you, Poppy? Yes. We're just after high water, and we're going to go up there a bit up the to the Chester Marina. Wouldn't really have wished for a better day. It's about the 20th of September, 2022. Lots of moored boats up here. I don't know what the prices are like, but plenty of them. I think that first one is Burden Marina and I'm guessing the one with the lock there is Chichester Marina. But who knows? I've been there, went to look for a boat to buy there. Didn't buy it in the end.
Yeah, that's all good. Look at the smoking Joe there, that's all following him, look. Get some sort out there, mate, it's smoke. There's no need. Interesting channel if you go in one of them marinas, it got very low coming across there. And we're not far off what was high water. We came across there. over this hump. Yeah. Gorgeous day. So according to her indoors, what we're seeing ahead of us is Del Key. This bit dries out at low water. Apparently we've got 7.8 foot we're on a falling tide. So we'll just go up and have a look. Not to get stranded. This is Del Key. Don't know the name of the pub, but it looks a nice one. Not that we would stop because we've been a picnic generally, but it looks a nice little place to stop. Um, but we wouldn't have much water after about an hour, so we won't. T40. It's a lovely place. Harbour office is rather luxurious. Sitting at lunch there. So I'm waiting to give it a scrub. Somebody eating their lunch and someone wanting their lunch. Shaken dog. 
couldn't be a better day, to be honest. So after a bit of lunch, we're now heading in the other direction. I think that way is the sea. That's why I think there's something called Bosham Creek. I don't know, never been here before. All learning. Shit. Brave soul having a swim. Good night, blues. Getting prettier and prettier. There's a lovely church here, who I presume is Oakham. Discovered the by accident because someone on the campsite said he had a boat here, so we asked him about it and he said it's a lovely place to launch. Oh dear, seagulls like that one, or the little birds. Oh, about an hour off low water now, I reckon. public cars I've ever used. You've got a pontoon you could tie up to, we didn't, but you can apparently. Oh, another lovely boat to over. This is where you can park. It's 
drive up the public hard. Park there when they're nearly at low water. Put stuff there. On the boats there. So they're giving the boat a good scrub and clear. So lot less time to break it all down than it does to set it up. But the space of hard you've got here. As ever, we decided to have a little coffee brew up on the hard. Still a beautiful day. <laughs>